Welcome at Gadgets for Gentlemen. My name is Lawrence and in today's video we're gonna have a quick look at the YZ Cam. I recently bought this device off of Amazon for only $23.99. The camera features 180p HD quality as well as integration with Google Assistant and Alexa. It features night vision and two-way audio. So let's have a closer look. These are the uh, specifications and as you can see it also features 8 times digital zoom, motion and sound detection, free rolling 14 day cloud service. That's tremendous. The competitors usually priced much higher. They have cloud integration plans that uh, run into the uh, 10 to $15 a month. This is the uh, YZ Cam version 2. It's compatible with both Android and iOS devices. Designed in the United States and made in China. And here we can see the logos of Google Assistant, Alexa, IFTTT. As you can see, uh, you can download the YZ app and have a live stream of your house. I bought this device to keep an eye on my living room and I wanted um, an affordable device with an affordable cloud plan. I previously owned the uh, Google Nest camera and I will leave a link in the description for that unboxing video. Um, I returned it because I thought the device was too expensive as well as the uh, storage plan was too expensive um, in my opinion and um, although the device is super user friendly I did see uh, a couple of shortcomings so with this device I hope to have a uh, better uh, experience um, just gonna give it a try uh, the device can be mounted uh, to the wall or you can put it on um, on the foot and just put it on a table for example. It has a wide angle lens and with custom zone detection and sensitivity settings you can receive notification when motion or sound has been detected. The motion and sound sensitivity settings can be personalized in the app and for me that is a big bonus, a big plus um, in comparison to the um, Google Nest camera which um, I could not really tweak the sensitivity. The video clips are stored in the cloud for 14 days for free. The camera has built-in infrared LEDs for the uh, night vision and you should be able to see clearly up to 30 feet away even in complete darkness. The mount is magnetic, so you don't need any screws to uh, apply it to a magnet magnetic uh, surface. Two-way audio uh, allows you to speak to, for example, your uh, friends and your pets. And you can even um, put in uh, a micro SD card for continuous recording and storage. And the camera will overwrite the oldest files when the micro SD is filled. So this way even when you have a uh, Wi-Fi uh, drop then you can still record using a micro SD. So you need a 32 gigabyte micro SD card if you want to continuously record in HD quality for two days. The YZ Cam automatically records a 12 second event video when it detects motion or sounds. Videos are securely uploaded to the AWS cloud via end-to-end -end encryption and are accessible for 14 days. No subscription or monthly fees required. So that is a big, big bonus. Unlimited storage. You can also order the device directly at yz.com for only $19.99. So I think that is enough information for now. Let's uh, open up this package. Here inside, uh, we can find the camera, uh, which is basically just a cube. 
Let's open it up. We can find the camera here in the front and there is a protection film that we can remove. Build quality is actually very nice. I'm surprised for $20 to see this kind of build uh, materials. So that was the camera. Let's have a closer look at the contents of the box. Inside we can find a quick start guide. Right here we have the um, lens of the camera and below this little dot we have a built-in microphone. On the back we have the USB cable slot. Below we have the power adapter slot. And here in the uh, bottom right we find a status light. And here when I take off this part Ah, we can see the feet. As you can see, this is the uh, stand. That looks very nice. Okay, this makes sense. So when we look here, um, top left, we can find the slot for the micro SD card. And top right, we find a button to set up the device. So that was actually quite useful to have a look at the layout of this device. Included is a USB cable, power adapter, the YZ cam, quick start guide, wall plate and mounting tape. So let's have a look what we can find here. Okay, so here I find the USB cable I presume. Yes, let's see USB cable. It's quite long as you can see, so that's perfect. We have this thing with the uh, YZ uh, logo. I guess this must be the wall plate and it comes with some sticky tape. Yeah, mounting tape. Yep, to avoid moist. And finally, we have the power adapter. Do pay in mind when you order it from Amazon, you will receive the American version, I guess. Uh, so I need to use another uh, socket for the USB cable. I'm just thinking about, because I'm here in Europe, so I'm thinking about using the plug from my uh, lighting cable for my iPhone to connect it to the electricity socket and here on the back we can see information how to set up the device we need to download the YZ app and create an account connect the camera to a power outlet and wait for 20 seconds until the yellow light status light flashes press the setup button for three seconds until you hear a voice prompt Follow the YZ app to finish setup. Very nice. And then we have the uh, light indicators. Solid yellow light, the device is powered on and initializing. Flashing yellow light, the device is ready to connect. Flashing yellow and blue lights, connection is in progress. Flashing blue light, the device is connected and finishing setup. Solid blue light, the device is working properly. So, very good, I'm just gonna execute these steps. So first of all, I'm, I'm going to look for the app. So let me download the YZ app. Yeah, and excuse me for the background noise, there's quite some fireworks. So this is the app. What we need to do next is create an account. Yes, and I'm just gonna allow notifications. I just downloaded the app. What we need to do next is press on the bottom right on the sign up. Up next we need to connect the USB cable to the uh, camera. So there we have it, I connected the cable to the electricity socket and now we're gonna hook it up to this device. And now we're gonna wait for 20 seconds until the yellow light flashes. So here in the uh, bottom right we should see a yellow light 
flashing and then we will need to press the setup button for three seconds. So I'm waiting here for the flashing of a yellow light and up next is I need to press the setup button for three seconds until you hear a voice prompt and for the setup button um, I need to lift up the device like so um, there we go that's the setup button it's right here so I'm waiting for the um, yellow flashing light to appear I guess this is still orange well actually I do think although this light looks orange this is supposed to be um, yellow so I'm just gonna press the uh, setup button here for three seconds until I hear a voice prompt ready to connect and we heard ready to connect so what I'm gonna do next is open the app again ready to connect so up next is I'm gonna open the YC app again ready to connect and follow the instructions so I think we need to choose new device and we can choose the YZ cam which is the first option yeah that's what we did these three steps next ready to connect okay next so what we need to do next is uh, scan the QR code that we have right here with the camera so I'm just gonna move it top of the uh, QR code QR code scanned please wait and now I'm waiting for the device to connect setup completed. so the setup is uh, completed so here you can fill in the name of the device there we go okay finish setup share with a family member nope yeah so this is the app I guess the camera is on so here it's installing some uh, new firmware so there we have it we have the um, camera working now um, this is the live stream I plan to use this camera to keep an eye on my living room I just ordered a micro SD card of class 10 32 gigabytes to um, be able to store videos when the uh, Wi-Fi uh, drops I am super excited to see how everything works and I might do a follow-up video just to show you um, how everything works this is the digital zoom um, it all looks uh, pretty uh, good I hope you found this video uh, useful stay tuned for a follow-up video if you have any questions or comments please leave them down below and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Many more videos to come. Have a wonderful day and see you soon.